Hey guys, I'm not even gonna explain or give you an excuse why I have not recorded in such a long while But I am here today and I'm gonna show you my favorites of 2016 and Let's just get started because I have a lot of things you guys and I don't even know where to get started So let me just sip a little bit of tea Because this is gonna be a long one. I would grab yourself some tea too because oh God, all right girl, let's get started so the first thing, oh, I don't even know where to start. All right, we're going to start with clothing items. So the first thing which, you guys, this is my new obsession. These pants are my life. My mom and my boyfriend are always yelling at me for wearing these. And my mom especially, she's like, I'm going to burn your pants. When she was the one that told me to buy them. So I don't understand. But they are these awesome two color toned and at the bottom they have like ripped um really ripped distress bottoms and that's what i really liked about these jeans because they're high-waisted they fit perfectly they look a1 plus one plus five on your butt and i really like them so much so i literally wear these every day i'm the type of person that i get something and i wear it until it's not wearable that's me that's me Next thing that I have here, which I actually got for $7 at a thrift store, and I was like, oh my god, oh my god, $7, you guys, right here. I distressed it myself, so, you know, a little bit of work from Leslie right there, also right there. And this is a Calvin Klein jacket, you guys, that I got at the thrift store for $7. The back has this awesome design, which <sighs> makes it even way better. Next thing that I have is something I've been obsessing over and it is the brand Adidas. I just obsess over Adidas like no other and this is a dress that I bought recently which looks super duper cute. Long sleeve and it goes actually pretty long down and that's what I really like about it. The next thing that I've been obsessing this past year is my Adidas jacket which is actually a kid size that I found in California but I was like... Um, we could make it work if we get a bigger size, and it did. This is the simple, you know, three stripes at the shoulder Adidas jacket, and I think personally it goes with every single outfit. You could not go wrong with this jacket. If you don't have it, get yourself one. Our bomber jackets, and these are velvet. I have a couple that are velvet, and they are just the most beautiful thing ever just to accessorize an outfit and just make it look A1, just wonderful honestly I love them and I also have this brown one right there really really pretty like that one too and the next thing I'm going to show you guys is actually a belt I've been obsessing over and this belt with those pants oh, you guys the perfect combo per perfect combo and this is the belt. I really, 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 really like it so much. It goes with so many stuff. And I actually want to buy the gold one. Next thing that I have down here are bralettes, you guys. These are some of my bralettes. I just... Oh, God. Who wears bras anymore? That's the real question here. Because your girl over here does not wear bras anymore. Bralettes have literally saved my life for the best. Next thing, I have an obsession with baseball hats and I didn't bring all of my baseball hats because it's just too much to show you guys but I love baseball hats like no other. They are my obsession. Oh, guys, look at this one. It matches my belt. Why? The next thing that I'm going to be showing you guys is a little bit of beauty stuff because you know Egyptian beauty Gotta throw in some beauty stuff in there. Alright, first things first. If you wanna... These are gonna be things that... If you wanna improve your makeup, this has done wonders to my makeup. And I've just noticed the difference. First thing is a beauty blender, which I actually never believed in beauty blenders. But my mom got me this for... I don't know. I think it was Easter. She got me this for an Easter present. And honestly... Oh, girl, this changed my life. If you do not have one... Invest in one because it will change your makeup game. 100% guaranteed by me. Next things next. As you guys could see by the reflection of the camera, you know. Highlighting. 
highlighting 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 has just been my obsession i used to think highlighting was gross and it looked disgusting and now i'm like all over it obsessed 100 percent love it and this kit right here you guys need to try this one out if you guys like highlighting or do not have it because honestly it's just the perfect highlighting it's just the perfect highlighter it looks really glowy as you guys could see and oh god i love it Oh, 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 the brush that I used to highlighting is a packing brush for eyeshadow, but I love using it for um, highlighting, and it's the Morphe M441 brush. If you guys are interested, leaves your highlight on point, on fleek, leaving it kind of bougie, you know? So the next thing that I have here is my Tarte Tardis eyeliner, and I got this for Christmas for my mom, and honestly, my eyeliner game has been on fleek. I love eyeliner and I stopped doing eyeliner for a while because I was using the Morphe gel liner and it was just a hassle dipping your pencil in there and it's the same thing as dipping your pencil in this but this is more liquidy than the Morphe one. It leaves your eyeliner really really matte and it looks pitch black so that's what I really love about that. And of course, prepping your face and all that is very important and what I've been obsessing over the last year is my Pond's um correcting cream and this is for dark spots and i've used to have a lot a lot of acne and this has really helped to clear those dark spots because it has vitamins it has vitamin c and b3 so i think that that has really helped my face clear up in the scarring process and i would definitely try that out and the next thing that i have here is my garnier skincare miracle cleansing water and this you guys is really really good for taking off your makeup in one swipe i really like it and it really feels fresh after you use it it doesn't feel oily it doesn't feel like your skin is how do i explain it rubbery it feels so natural and it feels like you just washed your face so this has really been a lifesaver especially for the eyeliner because you do not know the struggle of taking off this eyeliner, you guys. It's it's unreal. And for my hair, if you guys curly hair, if you guys have curly hair, you know the struggle of having curly hair. And I'm always trying new products to see which one works better on my hair. And I have to switch it up so my hair doesn't get used to it and starts to flatten out. So this is the Shia Moisture, and it's the Coconut and Hibiscus Curl and Style Cream. And this stuff is really good really good that's all i have to say about it this is the lush love lettuce face mask and these are the ones that you refrigerate and it just looks like this on the inside and you just put that all around your face let it dry up for 15 i do it sometimes for 30 minutes i just try having it the longest and after you take it off oh my god it leaves your skin like baby but skin next thing that i have here which i am totally obsessed with these candies they're pulparindos if you guys oh snap i'm just making a mess let's just move on i have a record player which currently i don't have right now because it i don't know what happened to it just stopped playing so i returned it but they're shipping me another one and these are some of the vinyls that i have for it the weekend some j cole up in here and some Lana Del Rey and good shit good shit my Polaroid camera and taking pictures of moments in my life that I've spent with my friends family just everything in general I just love keeping memories and this is a really great way to actually keep those all in one place and a, just a simple little picture where you could write a caption kind of like Instagram in a way if you think about it you guys are not gonna be surprised when I show you this next thing because come on come on yes I had to I actually got these for my birthday and I've been wanting some but I was just like mm, do I want to spend 80 90 dollars on shoes um so I, yeah my mom got my mom hooked it up for my birthday and got me these shoes and I just they go with everything just like the jacket I'll show you both of them because I just I don't know I don't know why I didn't bring the other one but these are my Steve Madden and they are velvet material and I've as you guys can tell by this video, I have a lot of velvet things and I've just been obsessing over velvet. This is another pair of velvet shoes, but a little twist to them. These are totally, 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 totally me. 100%. I just, oh God, thanks to a boyfriend for these shoes because 
he hooked it up he hooked it up look at these shoes look at these look at them oh my god so these are the puma and i'm not sure if these are the rihanna collection i feel like they would be the rihanna collection because they're velvety they're they look like the creepers but i'm not too sure if they're in her collection oh 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 the next thing that i have here i've been obsessing with chokers you guys but this choker right here oh god i just spoke i got this the other day and it's just this gold choker let me see if you guys could see it on there perfectly it's just this like really really pretty gold choker and it matches my puma shoes and another obsession that i have from 2016 is Hoodies, I just love, love hoodies, especially crop top hoodies. You guys, they save your life. You pair them with some high-waisted pants and just some bomb-ass shoes and you're set. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. That is pretty much it. I had a good amount of stuff. Um, it's stuff that I've been obsessing over and are my favorites from 2016. But for New Year's resolution, hopefully you guys are also wanting to try new things. And I believe that these are a variety of things that you guys would like in your life. And if you guys want to try it out, let me know how it goes for you. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that thumbs up. Comment also. You guys are slacking. You guys don't even comment on my videos. Very disappointed in you. Very disappointed in you. Alright, so you guys, thank you. Don't forget to subscribe, like I said, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. I don't wanna talk right now. Every time we do your hot and cold. You know what it is when the boss in town.